Hi, my name is Eddie Sparks. This is your man man for today. I hope you have a great day. I hope today is a good day for you. Uh, Melissa Beach Marketing, the owner, obviously. Today, I'm going to talk about marketing because that's where you really want to go anyway. It's the third branch of business, finance. Ca uh, finance is accounting, operations is where you work, and marketing is a little bit different because marketing is based on gross numbers, not on net numbers. Sales is based on net numbers. Marketing is based on gross numbers, which I can get into later. But right now, I just want to review in your brain how marketing works because it's hard to, to figure out whether or not marketing works. And um, I explain it pretty well. Marketing is a process of making sales material. So you need to make sales material to sell different things to different people. No one piece of sales material is going to close everybody. It's just not possible. If I was in Key West, if I was a towing company that had five counties, if I was in Key West and I needed a tow company, I'm not going to respond very well to sales material made in Miami because they're four hours away from each other. Three. It's just not going to work out. So marketing is a process of making sales material for different types of businesses, different types of closes, and different types of sales avenues. So. When you sign up for me, my subscription, which you should, shut up and just do it because I'm on your team and I'm going to help you make money. So sales material also deals with the introduction of your company. So if you come to me and say, Sparks, I really think there's money in property managers. I want to talk to property managers. I want them to be involved with my security company. So I'm going to make sales material for property managers and I'm going to do the best I can and then you're going to go to the to your sales meeting with the presentation that I give you with the sheet of paper that has property managers all over it and then you're going to listen write stuff down I'm going to adjust the sales material and then we're going to print 500 of them and since I have you on a subscription basis next month you might say hey you know what we're going to do we're going to do stores or we're going to do condominium complexes or we're going to do something else. It makes sense if you're a lawn guy, you want to do lawn at the hospital, that's a good account. It's big. Say, hey, I need, I need a presentation for hospitals. So I will make you sales material for a hospital. Put little people on there, whatever's going on. Next month, hey, I think there's money at gas stations. I want a gas station as an account. Well, marketing is about making sales material. But sales material is just about guessing. So we guess that there's money in it, and we guess that it's easy, or this guess is there's no headaches, or I guess that over time it's just easier to, to build this part of my portfolio because nobody's doing it. So I'm going to make you a presentation for gas stations. So you can go in a gas station, tell people how it is, explain to people that it's also about cleaning and, and blowing you know cigarette butts out of their parking lot and you might make money that way and have monthly accounts because everything needs to be monthly you never want to waste the time to make a sale for a one-time sale it always needs to be on some sort of recurring basis quarterly monthly weekly that's how you make money you can't build a business <laughs> you can't build a business without sales and you need to do sales all the time but you can't do sales without sales material you can't make sales material without a good marketing company. So that's what you need to think about, and that's that's where your hole is. So if you sign up with me, I'm going to work for you your whole life. I ain't working for you for one day. That's BS. Because <laughs> I'll never get to know you, your, your business, and such like that. And two, three years down the road, you're like something new comes around. But nobody knows that business like I do. So then you have low-end labor trying to help you make money, and then, you know, I'm going to be mad. <clears throat> <laughs> so marketing is process of making sales material sales material is not going to close everybody purple is not going to close everybody black is not going to close everybody green is not going to close everybody so shut up all that's hocus pocus great did a good job oh you used cartoons this month oh okay we'll see if that works oh you, you used you used this oh you changed my logo up a little bit you know all that stuff doesn't even matter what matters is whether or not the salespeople can make money if the salespeople can make money, then that's a good thing. And they need a, a quiver, they, 
pull that bow out and say, hey, I got that. Or I was just driving by and I saw this I saw this uh, shop right here and it's in my genre. I'm going to stop in there and just say hello. So um, that's how you build a business. You know, I'm not necessarily making these videos for my health either. Because I think this is a good avenue for my own sales. Because you need to learn that I'm good at business and you need to shut up and listen to me sometimes. And I need to shut up and listen to you. Um, being a man in business means that, you know, that's your hobby. My hobby is marketing. My hobby is making sales material. My hobby is finding money for you. That's, that's, that's my hobby. And when people come in and they're really passionate about something, then you know it's their hobby. And they're probably going to take it personal and they're going to take it a good job. If that's their hobby. So, you know, when it comes to marketing, marketing's not always going to monetize, but you'll always have that sales material. If I'm making pages on your website based on locations, that'll sit there and close over and 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 over again. But right now, we're just talking about general marketing and how marketing works. Sometimes it's good to say, hey, I like this magazine. It's a stupid magazine, and I'm just going to be in it because I have an ego. You know, we can talk about that. That's something you need to call me about before you make that decision, and I'll tell you whether or not it's a good decision or not. Um, I'm in Estonia talking about marketing. That's my favorite thing to talk about, and I'm going to roll through it the best I can, and I'm going to teach you what you need to know. And marketing is above sales, so the marketing department is above your sales. <laughs> so don't get that confused. I'm a good salesman too. I like I like to get paperwork signed. So. If you need marketing, here we go, because I'm going to talk about marketing for quite some time. I'm going to talk about marketing and genres, and I'm going to talk about how that's going to affect your business and how to grow your business in 2018 to 2025. It don't matter. So you can always look backwards or forwards or whenever this video is, because the principle is always the same. You have to continue to make sales material in order to get sales, and nothing is going to close everybody. So you got to keep going, bro. This is your Man Minute.